When I think about leaving hospital and the role the NDIS plays about discharge, I'm thinking about injury or illness that causes permanent and often new, complex and significant disability. These patients usually come to hospital through the acute pathway. They usually then transition into rehab models in the hospital. Rehab is really about preparing that person to reintegrate into the community. We work on adaptive and integrated strategies and consider a range of supports to get them back into the community. The imperative is to get patients as ready as best we can and out into the community as quickly as we can. Hospitals are not great places to be long term. We use our clinical experience and judgment to predict how much rehabilitation we can provide. Then we set a discharge date based on that. It's really important to have a discharge date to work towards. Inpatient rehab involves 24-hour nursing support and allied health professional input multiple times a week. When you need that level of intensity, inpatient rehab is the place for you. And when you don't need that anymore, it's not the place for you. Patients can only progress to a certain point in hospital. They need to transition into the community to practice skills and try all the things we've worked on. If the discharge date passes because there are some major obstacles, a lot of momentum falls away. When you're living in a highly supported environment, it can be really hard to be the independent person you can be.